Hello, hello, hi there, Chelsea Norton here, Monarch Alley. I am a vintage lover, thrifter, and reselling. And hey, my eyes are up here. I know you're looking at my baby Yoda pin. <laughs> and I'm rocking a Mando shirt that's totally like Motorhead. Yes, it's from um, Revenge of the Nerd is the seller or creator of that art. So anyway, I'm just really feeling Mando vibes today. The new season is out and I can't wait to start watching it. <sighs> I rewatched some old episodes to really get in the mode. Are you into Star Wars? Are you like uh, a little Star Wars nerdy like I am? It's, the Mandalorian is so good. Trust me, even if you don't know anything about the Star Wars world, I think you can really appreciate it. Anyway, okay. Today, I have a haul for you, but it is not a thrift haul. It's actually a consignment haul, but I didn't go shopping. No, I am doing a consignment deal with one of my friends who is um, just looking to offload some of her items and she's trusting me, she's trusting me to sell her stuff. So I'm really honored and I really appreciate it. I actually have two different friends that I'm doing consignment deals with right now. Um, and I would have done a haul with the other one, but her stuff just was is flying off the shelves too fast. Now the items I'm sharing with you today, I have not listed quite yet. Um, so you can get them early if you want to send me a comment or shoot me a DM on Instagram. My Instagram username is Monarch Alley. You can claim these items in advance if you are interested. Otherwise, I will be listing them throughout the week. So, okay. Um, I have a lot of, it's pretty much women's clothing, tops, bottoms, a couple purses, and some shoes. So I'm really excited to share with you all really great stuff. Okay, so I'm going to start with um, bags because <laughs> there are only two. But they're cute. I actually sold some bags for this person um, because she actually gave me some when I really first started reselling. So I really appreciate that. I'm always going to be grateful for that. She has excellent taste. So this is a Vera Bradley, just a little crossbody. Um, let me see. It's about head sized. <laughs> That's a really bad way to describe it. But anyway, this is a really cute pattern. I don't know a ton about Vera Bradley, but I do know that this is in great condition and it's a really cute um, smaller purse, which right now I feel like I need, I need to take it down a notch. I need to stop with the huge bags and get something like that to just throw the basics in. Um, another great bag is this. I love this color of brown. It's really like, um, a cam I think you call it a camel brown or like a light, um, a lighter brown. It's Michael Kors, as you can see there. And it's got this double strap thing going on, which is so cool. I love the chain. This is a beautiful piece. Like, I'm really excited to list this. Also good condition, um, some signs of wear because hello, it's a beautiful bag and it was it was used. But as you can see, a really great bag here. So I will say too ahead of this that I don't know exactly what I'm gonna list these items for yet. Um, I haven't dug in deep into research, but you know, I imagine a bag like that could go for $30 or more. Okay, I'm gonna do some tops and then shoes in the pants, okay? Are we all in it together? I find that knowing what's coming next really helps me process. So I'm gonna show you some tops. Um, we have this pink cardigan from Marisa's. What I really like about it is it's a lightweight cardigan. The sleeves are solid, but then the um, there's this detail on the back that's like kind of open, very breathable. So I really like that pink cardigan, very cute. All about the stripes, so I'm super into this next top. Um, let me tell you the brand. This is Hem and Thread, a size large. So it's black and white stripes, but then you have this fun detail here on the bottom of the sleeve. So it's basically like a three quarter sleeve, but then you add this. Um, so it kind of looks like there is a button up under it. So in the back, you can see it's, it's split in the back and it looks like you're wearing a button up there. Very cute, neutral piece. I like that a lot. Next, I have a raglan style, very soft and comfy. Oh my gosh, this shirt would seriously be so comfy. Uh, baseball type shirt, but hey, we've got the feminine, uh, the feminine floral details. <laughs> oh my goodness, have I had enough coffee today? I don't think so. Um, yeah, so really pretty piece. This is, you know what? I don't have a tag right at the top, so I imagine the information's like further in there, but um, I imagine it'd be a women's large. Don't know the brand. Very soft, kind of like LuLaRoe or just like a really soft, comfy type um, shirt. Words, words are hard. Okay, this is a seemingly kind of sim like um, 
what is the word I'm looking for? Like a basic piece, a great wardrobe staple, but then you turn it to the back and you have some sassy back there. So I really like the kind of boho look here in the back, um, but still like a light, soft shirt, really comfy, cozy. This is uh, a brand Paper Moon by, uh, designed for Stitch Fix. So I, I actually really like selling Stitch Fix stuff. I think like the style is always... Um, I don't want to say neutral, but it's something that a lot of people can wear and appreciate and look good in. So I really like selling Stitch Fix items. Okay, next we have another Marisa's top. This is um, a pretty, it's, I feel like it looks black and white, but it's really more of a blue. So I'm going to see if I can get in here. You can see some of those blue um, details there, the floral. There you go. So this is a soft sweater. Once again, we have like some cute detail on the bottom, but it's one layer. So we're getting a lot of really cute layered looks without like all the pieces. So for me, I really appreciate that. I'm not someone that can layer very well, unless it's like this, like a t-shirt and a flannel that I can easily take off. So this is a size extra large women's and it's very soft. I almost want to quickly look up the fabric contents. I'm guessing it's acrylic, but it's just so soft and cozy. Oh, it's polyester and spandex. Nice. Got a little stretch going on there. Okay. Sorry, my retail my retail background is, is happening where I'm like folding shirts like I used to at Hot Topic in 2005. <laughs> I worked there for five years um, in college and then a little bit after college. And it was actually a really great experience. The company had a great company culture and I, it was fun. It was fun working there. Even during the Black Friday and the like Q4 season, which was intense, like folding hundreds and hundreds of t-shirts over and over because people just wreck them. It was still fun. Isn't that crazy? Um, anyway, back to business. This is probably one of my favorite tops. Oh no, I have another good one coming. But I just love a good like plaid flannel top. And what I especially like about this is that it buttons um, only about halfway down and then it's just like a flowy bottom. I also love it when the sleeves, these are, I guess, three quarter sleeves, but they still have like a button detail here. Um, and I just especially love the colors and pattern in this, in this top. So love showing that off. So this is from Market and Spruce and it's extra large. Market and Spruce, that's familiar to me. Why is that? Hmm, do you know? Uh, really cute top there. <clears throat> okay, two more tops than shoes and pants. We're keeping our table of contents going strong here. <laughs> This is actually new with tags um, from Green Tea. It's a size small, so you can see the tag. Oops, I'm sorry. See, can you see it? Green Tea, and it has this um, tag with some really cool information about the dyeing process of this tie-dye top. Super in right now, super trendy tie-dye. I really like the pattern on this. So this is, once again, just a soft, comfy piece. All these tops I'm sharing are super soft and comfortable feeling. V-neck. And then, yeah, check it out. Oh, that almost looks like, whoa. Is that like a tree design or am I crazy? No, it's, I'm crazy. It's kind of the wrinkles from me having it folded. <laughs> I thought that looked like, I don't know, like trees in a lake or something. Hey, I'm a nature lover, what can I say? Okay, one more time. Uh, ooh, again with the stripes. I love stripes. But look at how cute. You have a little three-quarter length uh, sleeve, but then a little bell detail here. Ooh, I love this top. Okay, so it's a gray and white striped top. Once again, uh, it's by Tickled Teal. Once again, super soft cotton top with a little stretch to it. It looks like it has a high-low back, which is nice. Or like, is that the right term? Like, it's more normal in the front and then a little in the back, a little longer in the back so you can wear it with like your Spanx leggings or you know, whatever. So I really appreciate that. Okay, three pairs of shoes. Um, they're all dance goes. And you know what, they all look different. Like they all have their own unique style and I can really appreciate that. So uh, dance goes, I think these are all a size 40. No, these are a size 41. Leather dance goes, they are black. You can see the heel there, great condition. Um, I really like these elastic tops. So it's almost like a Mary Jane look, but then you have the crisscross detail there. Really cute. Dance goes. I remember when I first started reselling, every, all the videos I watched were like, dance goes, dance goes, get your dance goes. They're so 
huge, you know, or not huge, but popular. And they are, they definitely sell well. Um, I even sold a pair that apparently were like a slightly mismatched color. One, she was more of a red, one was a brown. I sold it without really realizing that. The person returned it and I approved that case. And then I sold them within like a week, even after disclosing it because they're just comfortable shoes. And honestly, the it wasn't that different looking, but anyway, they're a comfortable shoe, great quality shoe, leather, you know, so people really like them. So I'm excited to sell these. So I showed you the crisscross Mary Jane style, kind of more like, I don't know, what would you call this? Like a more casual look or a dressy look. And these have more of that, like what I picture as like a classic dance go look, the classic clog with these, like, I don't even know. I think of butterfly wings when I see that. What do you think of? But um, I really like the kind of hatch etched design there. So you can see also in really good condition. These are, you know, I'm not sure of the size. Oh, here we go. I could, I could find it. I'm going to show it to you while I look. These are size 40. Uh, the heel looks or the heel, the sole looks really good. So those are size 40. And then these next ones I love so much because they give me like, I don't know, 40s kind of 50s vibes um, because of the shape of them, the heel. Look at those, how cute. Okay, so these are brown. The other ones had were more like black gray. These, I don't want, what am I doing with my hands? I don't know. <laughs> These are, I'm just going to hold one shoe. So I am going to get these a little shine with my Dr. Martin's Wonder um, Balsam. Balsam? Balsam? Why are words so hard today? It's not a balm. That's why it's tricky. But um, just a really nice look there. I like the Mary Jane style with the two straps. And then um, these are also a size 40 leather upper. Really cute. Just a nice classic shape. And I imagine they are extremely comfortable. They look so comfy. All right. Are you hanging in there? Did you have a coffee? Did you get a beverage? Are you doing okay? I appreciate you. Okay, so next I have some pants. Um, most are denim. Most are uh, cut from the cloth brand, which is kind of fun. It's a brand I have sold before. I've had good luck with. They probably will sell anywhere from uh, 25 to $40, depending on the style. I'm, I'm guessing because I haven't looked up all of these particular styles, but... Um, so I'm going to show you some of those and then there's some really neat, uh, designs of other pants too. So quickly cut from the cloth. These are, whoa, sorry. I'm not tall. She is a little taller than I am. So it looks like a straight leg. A lot of these will say what they are. You can see they have cut from the cloth has like a few different patches. Um, these are size 12 and you know what? I don't have the style name, but Great pair of pants here. And what I'm excited about too in listing all of these is I think there's a lot of bundling opportunities here. For people that shop on Poshmark, like um, I, I don't think my closet currently has a bundle option turned on, but I when I see someone liking multiple items, I definitely try to like uh, put it in a bundle for them and send them an offer um, instead of doing that automatic discount because then I can shoot them a message and just really make them feel like they're getting a good deal and it's specialized for them. So that's the way I like to work it on Poshmark. Now on Mercari and eBay and the other platforms I saw on, it's harder to do bundle deals. Um, so if you have any tips for that, let me know. I know on Mercari, what some people will do and what people have done for me is to actually um, put the items like all in one listing. So if I say, hey, I want X, Y, Z, put it all in one listing and then put the bundle price in there. So I've done that before for a couple people and I've actually purchased on Mercari that way. And then for eBay, I don't have my, I don't have an official store. So I don't know if I have the capabilities to offer like a deal when you buy multiple things, but I might look into that. So these are cut from the cloth. Um, these are more like a, a classic denim that you see. I feel like these were a little stretcher of a fabric. This is kind of what I, when I think of like Levi, Levi's and classic denim, um, you know, the whiskering here. So these are a size 12 as well. And this does have a name, Stevie Straight Leg. I love that. It makes me think of Schitt's Creek. <laughs> Do you watch that show? I just finished the series and it was, I cried my face off. That show is so funny though. I love it. Okay. So cut from the cloth again, size 12. Uh, another, this looks like a skinny leg. Whoop. I'm so bad at showing this. I'm sorry. Um, I don't have a style name in here. So the other one said Stevie. Oh, wait. Nope, sorry. Cut from the cloth, though. Cute. 
just know that they're cute. It's, it is hard for me to show <laughs> jeans. I'm so sorry. Okay, so these are the Diana Skinny. I recognize that. I've sold those before. I think I sold those on Mercari for about $30 maybe. Um, so yeah, these are like once again kind of like a softer, stretchier material than that other kind of like more tough denim. It's not tough. Heavier denim is probably the appropriate word. And then these are another Stevie. All right, cool. Size 12. Stevie, straight leg. I like the look of these a lot. That's your classic denim look. You're not gonna lie, it would go well with a lot of the tops that I showed you today. Like I said, if you are interested, um, send me a message, drop a comment, send me a DM on Instagram, let me know. Um, I could sell off platforms for you and give you a better deal. So I have two more pairs of pants and then we're done those for the day. Can you believe it? Okay, so these are a pair of democracy, I'm gonna back it up, back it up. These are a pair of democracy pants and I love them. Okay, leopard print, how cool. So they are skinny leg, sorry, I'm not showing you very well. They have this very cool zipper on the side of the front pocket, um, which I really like. There's your label, size 14. And they have like, this is kind of an elastic band here, which is really neat. So I think they look really comfortable and really stylish. I'm gonna put them up there a little closer so you can like really see it. It's a little bit darker of a tan than I think is showing on the video, but I'll make sure to represent it well in my photos. And then these, oh my gosh, these are so cool. Okay, plaid. I love these! Plaid skinny pants, also democracy, um, size 14. And once again, that kind of elastic waist and the zipper pocket on the side, super edgy, I love these. They remind me of um, a pair of pants I got at Gadzooks in the mall when I was like 14 and they were plaid, um, like a plaid skinny pant that made me feel like Gwen Stefani and I wish I still had them. I wouldn't fit them, but I wish I still had them. Um, so yeah, that is, I'm gonna get up close. <sighs> That's our haul for today, friends. Thank you for hanging in there. Like I said, if you are interested in any of these great items, um, send me a message on Instagram at Monarch Alley. Drop me a comment here and I can get you some details. Um, or if you have any questions, you know, just let me know. But I'm really excited to be selling these items for a friend so she can just um, hopefully cycle that money back on Poshmark. I know that she buys some cute stuff on Poshmark and other apps um, or just have some money in her pocket for the holidays. Who knows? So anyway, uh, leave me comments if you have any questions. I appreciate your time with me today. Um, yeah, see you later.